So we collect computer donations from companies and institutions. We import them into Kenya. We have a refurbishment center here where we wipe the computers, install our own custom operating system, and then we deploy into schools. We also partner with youth in the community that we train uh, to run our classes. So our classes are part of the school curriculum. Our teachers are doing classes from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. and the kids are learning this every day as part of their curriculum. It's not a token project where they're doing it over the weekend or over the summer, no, it's part. And, and so by this, then they are, it's, it's really, it's so embedded that this is just something they're learning. When you have someone in grade one, they're gonna be doing it until they're in grade eight. <laughs> In this class, I've been taught how to use Visual Studio Code to make my own website using HTML and CSS. Then I've been taught about OpenShot and about NASA to make my own rocket when I grow up. So I hope this class will help me in my future to be a 19 expert. Close. I enter. 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 I close. I've been teaching kids how to develop uh, websites and uh, how they can uh, add some goodies on their website like. Uh, CSS, uh, images, videos, and uh, audios. Uh, this is something that will help kids uh, know how they, how they can brand themselves online and how they can uh, do business online because that's where the world is heading. Most of these students would not have used a computer because we're targeting the most remote parts of, of Africa. And so right now, we have students who don't even speak Swahili yet, knowing how to use a computer, building websites. And the coolest part is that they can still do that in their own village. They don't have to go to Nairobi to do that. They don't have to go to America to do that.
Uh, as a third world country, uh, we have been left behind in terms of technological advancements. I believe what Zawad is doing, actually taking these kinds of machines to kids who are in a marginalized area, will try and kind of equalize the playing field. Most of us were actually exposed to laptops at uh, 18 or our first time when we went to university. But these kids, exposing them at this early age, they will, it will enable them to be able to learn skills such as coding, programming, which will in turn, because we're living in a world where we're now going to digital currency, things like bitcoins, cryptocurrency, fintech, basically financial technology. Should these kids begin these particular skills at this age, I'm sure by the time they are actually uh, out of university, they will be implementing these skills and not looking for jobs like most of us did.